<clears throat> Hello fellow Minecraftians, welcome to the very first episode on this channel. Today's episode we're going to I'm going to show you guys how to build like a little suburban type of home. So what you're going to need is you're going to need birchwood planks. You're going to need some stairs. Sorry about this up here, by the way. I don't know why that keeps popping up. Here comes Does anyone know how to actually... I'm going to just turn that off. Yeah, I'm tired of hearing sound. Alright, we're going to need... I would just say birch stairs, birch wood. Let's get some slabs. We'll get some birch slabs. Let's go to clay. We're not clay. What is it? Uh, Not concrete. Oh, they changed... In, oh, terracotta changed the name. It's been a while. Alright, we'll get some light blue. We'll get some purple. I just want to see real quick. How do these look? Which one looks better? Oops. Broke the grass. Alright. Get this. And we... This is all we'll need for now. Actually, we'll get some cobblestone. Here we go. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to... Three, four, five, six... Go about six blocks. By the way, also got some glass. We're gonna use some glass panes. About one, two, yeah, about six blocks, guys. And then you're going to actually, we're gonna go eight, and I'll show you why. Maybe we'll do six. For now, just go eight, and then go up one, two, three, four, five. Go over one, two, and then one, two, three, four, five. Over two, one, two, three, four. Five. Five. Alright, so it was actually seven, not eight, that we needed. Alright, now what you're going to do is you're going to go up three with the glass panes here. Up three. And you're going to take your birch planks and you're going to go over just like that. Now, we are going to build a deck in this area. What we can do is we can continue it out with cobblestone, but this is a foundation. So, I think what is best is if we go out about four blocks, we go one, two... Go up right here. Well, actually, we'll go three blocks. We'll go one, two, three. One, two, three. Go like that, like that. And we make like a little L shape. And we're going to go this way. One, two, three, four, five, I believe. We're going to go all the way up here. All the way up here. One, two, three. One, two, three. I'm going to have a nice big window right here. <clears throat> it's like creativity, you know? Some good windows, just like that. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take our birch. Actually, let's take our cobblestone. We'll go like this. See how that looks. Mm, I'm not digging that so much. But I think what we're actually going to do, guys, is I think we're going to grab our spruce. So we'll break that cobblestone we just put and we'll replace it with spruce wood. I love spruce and uh, birch wood together. I think it just looks so amazingly good. All right, I think we're going to go to right here. We're going to go like this. And with it, we're going to go all the way up. Just like that. <clears throat> oh, sorry, this piece here does not need to be there. And we're going to break that. And we're going to put down some more spruce wood. Just like that. If you guys are still with me. Then we were going to take the cobblestone and go out one on each side. And we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six. Just like that. Now we're going to get stair. Oops, sorry guys. I'm going to get some spruce stairs. We're going to go one, two. Let's do four. We'll do it like that. And we're... Eh, this is going to go like that. Um, hmm. And this one here is actually going to come out two more. Let's fill it up for now. And right here, it's going to go up three blocks. Two, three. One, two, three. Just like that. If you haven't figured it out yet, this is where the door is going to be going. We're going to get our doors. And there's a lot of doors, but I think we might do dark oak doors. We'll try this out. We'll see how this one here looks. Now, I don't want it like that. Do I want it to like this? Nah, I'm not digging the dark oak doors, guys. Door. Let's see. Uh, I think we're actually just going to do normal doors. Hm. Alright, I think we're going to go like this. I like the normal doors, guys. I think it's just classic. Looks great. Looks good all around. And we're going to continue this out two blocks like that. And uh, we're going. We can get rid of that door now. 
And do we want to do it like this? Nope. We're going to want to do it in here. So, yeah, like I said, two blocks. And you're going to want to break that one and do it like that. And then we will get this glass pane. We're going to go one, two, three. You're going to go one, two. And actually, where we put the wood where it finishes, you're going to want to put the cobblestone on the outer edge. Just like that. So it kind of looks like this foundation right here goes into it. Um, we'll do it like that. From here, you're going to want to grab some, like, gravel. Or not not even gravel. Maybe not sand. What would look good? Like, uh, I guess this andersite would look good. Just put that right there. Andersite. We're going to get, like, a little andersite pathway. But leave this spot here empty. You're just going to want to go out like this. Oops. I'll do that for anyone who has OCD. We'll go like that. Uh, we gotta go one more. So it should look like this. Now we will come back to this part. But for now we are going to focus on the main house part. The roof will also be spruce wood. So we're going to come down here like this. You're gonna wanna do that. And you're also gonna wanna grab a slab. Spruce wood slab. This will go like that. And we'll leave these two up in here just in case we ever need them again, which we probably will. And you're going to, oh, wrong wood, my guys. I meant spruce, S-P-R, spruce. I grabbed a dark oak. Dark oak would also look very good because it's like, you know, it's the darkest color that it comes in. So it would look very good on this house too. We might actually, for this one right here, we might actually drop it down like that, like so. Yeah, that looks pretty good. And we'll continue it like this. Actually, we'll, fi we'll figure that out in a minute. But for now, this is what we want. Now we're going to go over here, and we're going to go back. I think one, two, three, four, five, six. We'll go back seven, because we want six blocks on the inside. And we'll go up like that. We'll go up like that. Connect it over. Oops. And I think, yeah, we'll add one in the middle. And we'll take our glass, our glass panes. And we'll go up, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Now we're going to take our, take our cobblestone, go back, one, two, three, four, five, six, six, which is right here. And we want this room to also go back six. So we'll go one, two, three, four, five, six. But if we want six on the inside, we're going to have to put seven because the wall will be right here. But seven looks kind of small, so I think we're actually going to do eight, so we'll put nine. Let me just time set it day for you guys. There we go. We'll do that. And then we'll come over this way. Like this. And we will... I'm not sure if this is what we want the final shape to look like. I'm just connecting it for you guys so that you can all see what it will kind of look like. Alright, now what we're going to want to do is we can fill in the spruce wood for the floor. I think this is going to be the final shape. We might add a little extension. Like so. Alright, we'll do that. Let's fill this all in. It would be awesome if I had like world edit right now, guys. But I don't, sadly. So, we'll just do this. You guys get the point. I might speed this process up. Uh, hopefully I don't forget to do that. Alright, almost done. There we go. Now we have the whole floor, and it will match, you know, the roof. You guys can change the wood if you like, but I like to mix it up a little bit. I don't really like them all to look exactly the same. So now what we are going to do here is we're going to dedicate areas. Now when we come in here, what we could do is, I think what we actually want to do is we want to have the kitchen, like right here. Because you always want the kitchen by window, either looking out the front yard or the backyard. It just makes for the most beautiful, I guess, style. Now what we are going to do is we're going to put a whole line of birch across this wall. And right here we're going to go up, and we're just going to connect it. Oops. 
but just like so. And right here, we're going to add one, two, one, two. And I think what we are going to do is just fill this whole little area right here in. Because remember, as windows do look good, you don't want to have an overly obsessive amount of windows because you don't, you want to have space to put stuff on a wall, if you know what I mean. You don't want to just have windows and you can't put stuff anywhere. So we're going to do this. Mm, also notice how this looks a little weird here. So I think we're going to do this. And just like so. Or we could do a different style on the front. I think what might look good is if we go like this. We could add single windows. Tell me what you guys think. Tell me what you guys think down below. Tell me what you like the best. But I think for now we're going to add single windows because it gives it like a little different difference between that and that and you know all this. Differentials. Alright. So now we are going to do the same with this side. We are going to fill in this. Also, one thing I recommend is if you have a window here, you always want to like cross put a window here. You never want to put birch here and then continue the window there. It just looks weird. You want to have that one panel in the middle. So we're going to add a window there, and then I think we are going to fill this whole thing here up. Just like so. And you're going to find a dedicated spot. I'm thinking right here would be good. Would be good or pretty cool. You're going to want to do something like that. You could go three high, but just make it four wide if you do decide to. And you are going to bust out this bottom piece right here. And you're going to go like this. You might even want to do it like that. But for now, we're just going to do it like this. You're going to take your wood and continue it all the way through like that. Now what you are going to want to do is you're going to go all the way up to the top where you were. I think I'm just going to go up three high. I think it will look better. To Oops. This might interfere with the roof. So we're going to do it like that, actually. And we want to go like this. For now. We might come back and change it. Let's see how that looks. If we put a slab over it. Eh, we like this here better. So we're going to do this, and then what we are going to do is we're go still going to put our birch back right here. Don't worry, guys. And we're going to just fill it in and put some upside-down birch there, just like that. Now you got a window with a little sill, and this is what it looks like on the outside. It's quite cool on the outside of the house. It gives it like a little bit of shape, a little bit of color and texture. And if you guys want to, you can actually... Uh, if you want to match it with the roof, you could do something like this, but you might not like how that looks from the inside. It will give it a little pizzazz on the outside, though. You could even continue it off just like that. Do whatever you guys want. But I'm going to leave it birch. Just like this. Here we go. <clears throat> Beautiful. All right. Now let's get back inside the house. We're going to want a designated spot for a back door. Now, since we come in and the front door is over here, and we're planning to put the kitchen over here-ish, maybe a dining room, maybe the kitchen over here, you know, we'll figure it out. We want the back door to not be in the way. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to go up right here a little bit more. Like this, like that. And we're going to grab our windows and go like that. And I think the back door will be right here. Now, there will be a back deck, so we're going to do that. And let's go grab our doors again. Now, depending how you guys like your doors, some people like to place them like I do. So when you're on the inside, they look like this. And when you're on the outside, they look like that. Uh, some people like otherwise, other ways, you know, the complete opposite. Some people don't like doors at all. It's whatever you, it's your opinions, whatever you like. So I think what we're going to do is, like I said, we're going to give this house a little bit more shape. We're going to break right here. Go out like that, and we're just going to go out one more. Even one more can give it the slightest bit of shape. Go like that. Grab your birch. Looks beautiful. Go like this. Go like this. So from the inside, it looks like that. And from the outside, it looks like that. And what we're going to do is we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six. It's going to come out three. Oops. And over here, 
you're going to want to connect the cobblestone and you're going to want to make a nice long deck now the reason I say three blocks is be oh, I'm going to connect that cobblestone is because we're going to take this cobblestone and go all the way throughout just like that now we will come back to this back deck but first we're going to have to break actually we you can leave it there because no one's going to see it because we're going to put the birch right over it anyways it's like a nice little marker <clears throat> now like i said i think we're going to do one window one window leave some space where you can put some stuff and have a nice big double window or we might do a double double and we could do another double or we can leave some space Nah, I think we're going to do that double, guys. Two, three. Oh, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Same over here. All right. Now that that is done, we're just going to take a second to uh, look at it. Yeah. All right. So I think I know what I want to do. I think what we're going to do is we're going to one, two, three, four, five. I think we're going to have this type of stair. It looks a little short, so we'll go over two more here. Yeah, just like that. We're going to grab our glass panes, and we're going to go like this. All the way over down here. But we don't want that to be the only way up. So, right here, we're going to put a nice... Now, let's get a three, three wide staircase. There we go. Now, that, that right there, guys, is looking beautiful. What we're also going to do is we're going to go up one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, oh, one, two three, three, four. And right here, we're not going to do it. And we're going to grab our stairs and go like this. Okay, we're going to grab out our slabs. And we're going to connect them. And at the end, let me just time set day again. There we go. It's going to go like this. And where this one should have been, right here, oh, there we go, we're going to want to go all the way around that, like this. And then you can break it, and connect it like that. <coughs> and what we're going to do here is just a little bit of this. Alright, beautiful. Going like this. So now, it looks perfect. Alright, let me just... Taking a second to think. Ah, right, yeah. So this looks good. One, two, three. We're going to go over this way. <clears throat> Just like this here, guys. And keep in mind that this... Yeah, I think that looks good. What we're going to do, I think, is go down here like this. Yeah. All right, beautiful, guys. Now, keep in mind these are slabs... So they are one block higher, so you can't put anything on top. So if you want like a chimney or something, you're going to have to break into it. This is going to have to wrap around here, and we I will get back to that. Probably don't want to actually connect it to the house yet, because other stairs might go in that general direction. I'm not too sure yet. All right. Oh, forgot to do it right here. Probably do this part with a block, but I'm using slabs. It's the same. It's all the same. Uh, again, right here. All right, there we go. <clears throat> now, it is a little dark. We will add some lighting and stuff later on in the video in this episode. All right. And now, let's take a little look. And uh, so far, guys, it's looking pretty good. All right, guys. Well, that's going to be the end of episode one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, stay tuned for episode two. It will. There were, all the episodes going to be up in the same day. And, uh... Like, subscribe, comment down below what you want to see us make. And uh, thank you guys so much. And uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next one. Alright, be sure to check out, check out our other pages. Alright, thanks guys. Bye.